My name is Lindsay Schwickert and I was hired by CS Porter as a dance educator where we integrate the curriculum that they are teaching here at the school along with dance and movement. Find an asymmetrical shape with your entire body. That's beautiful. Why was this touch you right down the middle? Let's see your Christian stiffer on both sides. Olivia's different. The value is very high. I would definitely recommend it to other schools. I've just seen them flourish. I've not only seen them come out of their shell in a different way that you don't see in the classroom with the dance, but I see them excited and I see them smiling and I see them moving and I would definitely recommend it for other schools. Um, this week we're working on symmetry and asymmetry and how we can incorporate our bodies in finding angles in other lines. Angle is less than what? Less than how many degrees? It's 90 degrees. Less than 90. So like, just so we have an acute angle right here with Christian's legs. Olivia's using her whole body. Oh, Maddie's found it with her knees. Our, we're using our bodies how to explain, like the like to solve the equation. And most kids when they think they're going when they're going to math, they'll think, oh, this is gonna be so boring. I used to think that, but every Thursday now that um, we have dance class, I was like, yes. But when you're in this class, you can't just go to sleep because you're yeah. doing something. But I believe learners of all ages need to move their bodies to understand concepts better, to engage all our senses in our learning, and because it's joyful. We have danced mathematical concepts. Uh, today we're going to be doing coins. Right now, I want you to choose for yourself, penny, nickel, or dime. Don't tell anybody, don't say it out loud. Choose for yourself, penny, nickel, dime, or high, medium, or low. What you have, it's like you have this thing and you can turn it into a dance. The movement class has been a wonderful experience for my class. They've um, looked forward to Wednesdays when Lindsay comes. I've seen an increase in vocabulary. There's been carryover into not only the science and social studies, but also other areas of our curriculum. Does everyone have a partner? Oh. Yeah. Yeah. No. Let's see your Logan, you can help no. me with Bonnie. No. I would okay. like to <laughs> And it really helps them learn about things like self-control and boundaries. Uh, it, it really draws on their creativity because they do a lot of their own choreography. So it's very empowering. Neat choices using all three levels. Wow, and some dancers are so frozen. It's really fun and it makes me feel great. 